exact situation of the source. So this is occurring aside. The next thing we want to see is now we have already in the out of three we have seen about the God and the soul. Now we're going to look at this darkness or the mind or the bondage we call it. The, the thing that creates ignorance in the souls. This thing has in Intama we say it has Ananda Sakti. Ananda Sakti means um, it is it has the power for example even uh, the example is also been quoted in Siddhartha Sangha. It says like sun. The power is not versatile. I would say the power is uh, the power from this darkness is um, it has multiple power sword. So let's look at the example. It is something like the sun. The sun gives out so much of rays, multiple type of rays. When the sun's ray hits the plants, the plants make photosynthesis. But however, when the sun hits human beings, we don't create food. Only the plants does. The effect of sun rays towards us is much different. It's totally different from what when it hits the plant. So does this sun rays touches every single thing in this planet of Earth, and it gives different, different, different effects on it. So does this darkness, this bondage, this maya, or this malam. Malam is the perfect word in Tamil. So this malam, when this malam emits its energy, the multiple energy, upon the souls, according to the soul's ignorance level, it creates more darkness and it creates so much of reaction and outcomes, such as, we also can see three main things, extremely high desire, extremely high anger or excessive of laziness. It creates these three things. Laziness is like uh, you feel so drained out all the time sort of feeling. You know, it creates these main things. So this is what's happening. So as a supreme being, God looks at this scenario and he thinks that because he is the most knowledgeable, he thinks that he should help these souls. So he creates the, he creates a playground or the situation for the souls to gain knowledge because souls also have another characteristic where if you help them, if you teach them, they will, they will know, they will gain knowledge. All right. So with that thing said, God creates few things. So the first few things that uh, the main things that He created is um, if you have been to any side of side side stand classes, definitely you would have known. You will be familiar with these words. Tanu karada bubada boga. So when it comes to tanu, if tanu literally means God creates so many different types of bodies because souls are always there, no. But the souls are given different type of bodies because um, Sai Vistana believes in reincarnation. So we were given so many bodies. So these bodies, even they quote how many types of bodies are there, mm, pretty much 84 lakhs and more types of bodies. You know, so this uh, a species they say. So God creates that. Uh, that after that, what God gives you karana, which are the tools, basically sight, listening power. Uh, do you have hand or not? These kind of things. What's attached to your body for you to uh, be physical or for you to experience?